<laughs> Say man, what's the tea? It's your girl Sydney and uh, welcome back to another reaction. I was gonna say another video, but it's a vid. It's a vid, but it's a reaction, all right? I saw a snippet of this on my Instagram and I just knew that I had to react to it. <sighs> pressure. He's pressure. I wanna see what's going on. I I've never heard of this channel before. We about to see Jack Harlow chicken shop date. Chicken shop date. It's a date at the chicken shop. Let's get right into the vid. A e e. What's for them? Mm. Good start. Okay. So I went to your show last night. You were there. Yeah. So what did she say? <laughs> I like the accent. I went to your show last night. I'm just a little delayed. So I went to your show last night. You were there? Yeah. Did, you, did you not see me? No, I didn't see you. I was waiting for you. Okay. I, I believe like, you. Hello. I didn't see you. What was the guy? There was a guy at the front and she had a sign. What did it say? Fuck me. <gasps> what? What am I watching right now? And why is he so fine? Like his eyes is piercing blue. Like you feel me? They just not they not just blue. They piercing me right now. Good teeth, like you feel me? Like they his natural. We love the natural. Okay. And he got the little studs in the earrings, alright? And the little curly hair on the top. He ain't looking too bad. This is the beer for me. What's your type? My type? Mm-hmm. What is he drinking? What is a Ribera? What's your type? What? Mm-hmm. Ribena? Is that like 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 uh England's like um Capri Sun? Like Dark hair. <laughs> That's a coincidence, Jack. She's sick. Why does this feel mad awkward? Like you know what I like? Yeah. Where I'm from, I don't know if they have it out here. They have little boxes in public. You can open them up, and there's little books inside. It's a little library. Yes. Take a book, put it back. Never done it. I just like walking past them. Can you read? What? Do you... What the hell is this? Do you? Sorry. Bro, wait. Hold on. What did he just say? Boxes in public. You can open them up and there's little books inside. It's a little library. Yes. Take a book, put it back. Once again, am I bugging? What is he talking about? What is he talking about? In public, there's boxes. You open them up, put a book. People are yelling outside of my house right now. And it's like one in the morning. But anyways, what is he talking about? If you know what he's talking about, Every time I go to talk, but if I get up, I'm going to be doing bugging out. Anyways, comment down below if y'all know what he's talking about. Maybe I know what he's talking about, but the way he's describing it don't make sense. Or maybe he's just making this up because I don't know what... What is he... One more time. You can open them up. I don't know if they have it out here. They have little boxes in public. You can open them up and there's little books inside. It's a little library. Yes. Take a book, put it back. Never done it. I just like walking past them. Can you? You lost me. You lost me, Jack. You lost me. I don't know about the book and putting it back. I don't. Do you... What the hell is this? She said you know how to read. Do you... Sorry, I meant, do you like to read? I do. I heard that your weakness is for girls born in the 70s. It's true. I was just wondering, like, what about the 90s? Is that? I like the 90s. Cool. But something about the 70s. Yeah. Well, what about it? Well, <laughs> you are stupid. I'm stupid. Yeah, like in a good way. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I feel mad awkward watching What's this right this? now. Ribena. Ribena. Mm -hmm. Did you like it? It's delicious. Mm -hmm. First one. And I had my first Leucozoid the other day. Leucozoid? The orange drink. The Lucozoid. Lucozade. Mm. 
He has a nice smile. Laugh. Right laugh. Like, what? stuff like that. that. What? It's like a Manchester thing. What do you say? Do again? Instead of really, Rola. Or at the end, Rola. Uh, yeah. Fauna. 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 Just do a, do a whole sentence of something. Do a whole sentence of something. Oh, that was quite good. Quite, yes. No, no, yes. Quite. Quite. No, yes. How, how are the wings? Oh, the wings. Quite exceptional. <laughs> A bit of spice, but they're alright. <laughs> Bruh, I don't know why I feel so... I I'm just an awkward person in general, okay? I just hate awkward situations. If I'm talking to somebody and I feel like the conversation is dying down and about to start getting awkward, I start talking to fill up the void, alright? I just don't like awkwardness. And I'm getting awkwardness from this video, but I can't tell if I like it. <laughs> like, is this, a, is this the aesthetic? Why are you showing me chicken and fries after every question? Like, I don't know what's going on. What's your best chat up line? Oh, hi. Is that it? Undefeated. Hi. You know what else is undefeated? Hi, I'm Jack. You're shaking. Am I? <laughs> yeah. Don't start this shit again. <laughs> No, what he said is really a fact though. Like I hate when people try to do three much to impress somebody when they're first meeting them, first introducing themselves, yada 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 ah ah ah. Just just be on your real gentleman suave. Like when Jack was on the carpet with Sweetie and he said that, he was really like Talk your talk, youngin. Introduce yourself to me, shake my hand, and give me a social and then maybe we can move on from there. I saw you hang out with H. Mm. He's one of my exes. I've heard. Ah, oh, the T. That's why I came in here a little bit reserved. We're good friends. I'll try to keep it that way for y'all. Okay, cool. I love H. I know. He loves you. He was telling me all about you. Really? Mm. What did he say? Wild shit. No, he didn't. That's nothing to say. I'll be seeing him under your pictures, too. Oh, yeah. He is obsessed with me. Spending time with somebody else and I get to wishing that she was you. Any girl could be beautiful, but not any girl can just be in tune. And you so in tune and you understand me. <laughs> I make you laugh and you say to me that you can't stand me. You soul food and you eye candy. I want to meet you in Miami and I want you to meet my family. Mm, okay, well, I'll just check my schedule and see if I can. I would meet his family. I would meet his family. I would meet his family. But I probably can. What, like, is the most romantic thing you've done for someone? Bought them a plane ticket. Was it private jet? No. Oh. Okay. Back. Economy. 58C. Have you reached? Is y'all taking a flight out for Jack and seat 58C? If, the, if it got 50... Cuteness yet? No. I know you're still getting cuter by the hour. <laughs> You are funny. I know. Um, I think I got like four years to pee. Four years, okay. And then it. Did you have braces as a child? I did. So did I. Really? Yeah. I don't know they did those over here. What? <laughs> Obviously they do. <laughs> what am I she watching? Goes, what you next? How many children do you want? Many. Many? All girls. Really? Yeah. I want eight daughters. Oh, 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 you went from the love of my life to 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 the to the to a nightmare. <laughs> the fuck? you want eight girls? If I had eight girls, I would never have eight girls. If I have two girls, I'm stopping after that. I'm a girl, so I could say this. Okay, it's my answer. And where would you live? Would you live in a big house with London. them? London. Oh, you live in London. In a flat yes. on Oxford Street. Eight daughters. Eight daughters. <laughs> a single dad. And you'd be like rapping around town. <laughs> Still. Rapping around town. 
what is this? I'm so lost as to what I'm watching right now. But I can't stop watching it. Would you ever move to London for a girl? For a girl? Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Yes. Yes. Right. Can you cook? No. Oh. Mm. Not to worry. Can you? No. Ah, uh, to worry. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my, all right, so that's, that, that, um, listen, this is my question for y'all. If your significant other does not know how to cook, is that a deal breaker? Like, females, if you're a man, don't know, or females, if you're female, whoever your partner is, if your partner does not know how to cook, is that a deal breaker for y'all? Is you gonna be the one cooking all the time, and then when you tired, you gotta order out? Because they don't even know how to make, like, spaghetti? Let me know. It ain't the deal breaker for me, but I'm about to teach you a few things. I don't even know everything, but guess what? We could learn together. We could learn together. I need to, to pee. By all means, don't let me stop you. I'm just gonna, Bob, I'm gonna wait. Is that your outro? You about to get up and go? Take a bit of the piss. <laughs> Take a bit of the piss. Is that it? Can you dance? A little bit. Ooh. <laughs> Somebody's been on the internet. <laughs> <laughs> I feel s I don't even know what to do with my hands right now. What did I just watch? And did I like it? <laughs> uh alright. That's it for this video. More the story is, Jack, if you ever see this, I got dark hair.